What's up everybody, Neil here with Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Today I'm going to show you a cool mod to add to your Nexus 7 which will let you change your lock screen to be different from your your default wallpaper on your actual home screen. So as you look now, your lock screen is just going to basically reflect what your wallpaper is on your device. And uh, it's not as easy as to change as, uh, as other devices or um, operating systems, but Today I'm going to show you an awesome quick little mod that you can add via Expose Framework. Alright, so first thing you want to do, you need a rooted Nexus 7 device running Android 4.4 or above. Next thing you need to do is download Expose Framework onto your device. After you've done all that, download and install the Expose Lock Screen Wallpaper mod. See right here? You're going to install it, you're going to go back into back into expose you're gonna to go to modules you're gonna select it and you're gonna restart your device I've already done all that so let's go into the actual mod now this will actually make its own icon you can change the settings from here so it's pretty straightforward um, you just select background style there's a default which is what you already have on your device there's color fill which changes it into a, a solid color which is uh, also pretty cool Let's take a look at this real quick. And you don't need to restart your device after every change, which is also very uh, awesome. All right, so you can also do a custom image, and you can do see-through. See-through, which is basically just tints the screen, and then it shows your wallpaper in a different tint effect. But let's show you real quick. There's custom. I already have a custom image that I've set, but you can choose through your gallery. And then you can also set a blur to your image. So let's take a look. So there you go. There's my blurred image. You can also select to not blur it. Uh, pretty straightforward mod. All the links are provided in the full article, which you can check out on Nexus 7 Soft Modder. And um, this is definitely a, a, a second option if you don't want to use Gravity Box, which is a little bit heavier on your device. This is uh, pretty straightforward if you don't need Gravity Box and you just have a little issue with your lock screen not being able to change it, then this is definitely a, a quick alternative. So, hope you guys like that. Check out the full article for the links in Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Remember to like, subscribe, leave a comment if you need any help. Thanks.